Hello, my name is Peter from Tusando, and today I'm going to show you how to easily and cheaply take care of your bokdo with wax. So here I have an uh, old bokdo, which has been used quite a lot. The way we're going to take care of it today is, first of all, uh, there's a lot of old o leftover uh, well, oil, maybe some, uh, some varnish on here. So we want to take that off, we want to do that with some sandpaper. So before we began, I'd been doing it slightly, but I'm going to do it here with the grain to make sure that it gets even all over, just like that. So I'm going to show that more details afterwards. When you have done the, the sandpaper, there's still some residue of um, leftover wood uh, on the bokto. So you want to take that off with a slight piece of wet paper and just take off uh, everything as you can. Make sure to get into the small nooks and cranny, crannies, crannies and nooks. And make sure that everything gets nice and clean. And when we've taken a look at everything and it looks good, then you want to take your, your wax, which we have here, and then apply it evenly across the entire bokuto. Now there is many common mistakes when it comes to putting on the wax. One thing being uh, starting a little bit here and then going over there a little bit. This, this will not heat up the wax, so it will not apply it. So you have to make sure that you use the same spot and go back and forth. Try and make a big motion so that you apply heat and then you can see the wax will start coming on. Another common mistake is to take really good care of the blade but not to take care of the small parts down here and the small, uh, the small dent in here. The problem is the wood grain actually goes this way. So the way the, the tree gets water is from here and from here. So it run, if water comes in here, it will run through the entire thing very easily. And when wood gets wet, it has density rot. Or if it changes in the weather, it may warp or crack in some way. So please be careful about that. Once you have applied the wax, you want to take a towel and buff it so that any leftover residue from the wax get nice and also it gets a little bit of a shine. Once you've buffed it nicely, you can feel there's a nice texture to it. So it's a little bit smooth, but also it sticks a little bit to your hand. That's the kind of, that is the feeling you want. So this has been an easy to do, a very cheap way to take care of your bokto. Uh, hope you enjoy. Thank you very much.